sure you're wondering why I'm not in the living room. Sabella's in the living room, <sighs> making a potion to get the stains out of her shirt. She's been at it all night. Magic is louder than you would assume. I wouldn't mind if I had some coffee or something. I'm also just trying to stay up so that when Jack comes home, she's not running into Sabella alone. Jack's been staying out a lot lately, but I feel like I should be there if she does come home tonight. Not that I think Sabella would do anything to hurt her, but Sabella is a witch, and Jack is just a human. Like, I'm just trying to be careful. What is what? Oh my god. I'm fine. Jack, what happened? Nothing, nothing happened. She was stabbed. Stabbed? Someone stabbed you? And punched her in the face. Okay, okay, just someone let's get some ice for her lip and a towel for all this blood. And my whiskey for the pain, please. Thank you. Jack, tell us what happened. What? I work at a bar downtown. That's what happened. She got some guy kicked out, and then he stayed till we closed, and stopped him. It's not a big deal, okay? Yeah, that's what you said the first time. The first time? Dude, how long has this been happening? Not long, okay? Like, a couple times a week. Dude! For what, like two weeks? Wait, are you the reason that I have been smelling blood in the middle of the night? It's not always my blood, okay? Right. Because you didn't bleed when he stabbed you. Dude! Put this on your face. Look, Jack. I know this guy rubs you the wrong way, but maybe he's off a little. I'm sorry, who are you? A snitch. I'm Bobby. I... <laughs> right. Um, you girls got this. I'll see you at work, Jack. Yeah, yeah. Jack, why didn't you just call somebody? Because I thought you were asleep. You both should be asleep. If it doesn't matter, you should at least call someone. I'm fine. I'm fine. Look, I know we don't always get along, but neither one of us are going to leave you downtown in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of the night. Call me, call her. And why does it matter all of a sudden? Why do you care? Because you're my roommate. roommate. I'm your roommate, not your charity case. So back off, Sandra Bullock, because this isn't the blind side. I can take care of myself. I'm fine. Be in my room. So that was last night. I haven't talked to Sabelle or Jack since. Sabelle took a nap and then went to work. She left some salve for Jack, but other than that, she didn't really say anything. I think she's a little hurt. As for Jack, well, she hasn't come out of her room yet, so I have no idea how she is. Hey. Hey. Jack, you look a lot better. Yeah, I told y'all last night it was fine. It's... It looked worse than it was. I mean, still... I drink a lot of water, fluids and stuff, you know? Hmm. So, are you going to tell me what actually happened now, or...? Nothing. Like I said. Honestly. And hey, if you think I look bad, she's in the other guy. <laughs> Dumbass. Okay, as long as you're not in any kind of trouble. I'm not. Don't worry about it. Okay. Oh, um, Spell left this for you. She said it's for soreness or something. I don't know, she was really worried. We both... Don't. I've been taking my care of myself for a long time, you know? I'm pretty good at it, too. So, uh, don't worry. Anyway. Later, Ed. Well, I guess that's it, then. You know. Not like that was concerning in any way. Uh, I'm just gonna let my roommate live her life. I'm not going to get involved. I'm not. 
szerokkal.